Hello Amazon.com, my name is Bo Shevasu. I review all sorts of fun, fantastic things here on Amazon and across the internet. Today I'm coming to you with this fun little um, neck gaiter thing. It's usually called buffware, um, but, uh, but this is a kind that I've never tested before. This is specifically from Scavor or Scavor, I don't know how it's pronounced, my apologies. But a very, very impressive design. Is that not very cool? I actually have two designs here. You must see both of them. I really like this. This is something out of a, a Pokemon or an anime cartoon or something. Isn't that awesome? So um, I'm actually going to be comparing this side by side with what I am familiar with. And that is Buffware right here. This I got from REI. It, they're, they're pretty expensive for what you get. Um, but it's about the same length. And uh, you'll notice here that this one is is a bit softer. It's like cotton almost. And these ones from Scavor or Scavor. I'm just gonna say Scavor. Let's do Scave, as in scabies. <laughs> uh, this is a bit um, bit more like polyester, a bit shinier. Um, not as stretchy. It still stretches. But uh, here, let me just show you an example right here. You'll see that. Um, it uh, takes a little doing, but once it is on, it uh, it stays put relatively well. If you're going to use this for uh, for snowboarding or, or paintball or something like that, I would suggest um, not using this as a, as cold weather type deterrent. I would get something a lot thicker. Uh, if you're going to use it just to cut the wind a little bit or just look really awesome, then uh, this is right up your alley. Um, you can also use this there. You can use these for so many different things. You can use it like do rag style, like that, or you could. Oh man, these are so much fun! I've I've spent uh, several several hours with these things. I, I have literally hours with with buffware up on top of Mount Rainier, rock climbing, mountaineering, snowboarding, skiing, you name it. So let's actually uh, put this one inside out, and then we are going to give it a twist like that, and then we are going to put it over itself. And effectively, what we have created is your own little homemade hat, which you can use underneath your snowboarding helmet or rock climbing helmet or something like that. And you can just see the, the little spin on top. Uh, or, this is also pretty cool, I, got, I gotta show you these things. These are, these are so versatile. Um, simply hold it like this this and then like this almost as if it's a muff grab here grab here so palm up palm down grab here and then when you pull like that it sort of creates a knot in the middle and then on one of the ends you simply kind of splay it out and it is your own personal do-rag how awesome is that and so the difference between this and the other variety that I just showed you was the other one was the knot on top. You'll see nothing up there. And there is a bit of a knot on the very back like that. Wow, I'm out here in the summer sun and these just got pretty darn hot. Um, now I'd say that the main difference between these two, this is a bit more expensive, the typical buff buffware, and then from the Skavor. These right here are, um, well, first of all, a lot cooler patterns, but also um, I'd say a bit thinner. I can see through the one from Scavor and the one from Buffware. I can't really see through. They're, they're slightly thicker. Um, but overall, I would give this a five out of five stars. I would definitely, definitely use this out on the slopes. Um, it is made from polyester. And uh, so, so keep that in mind. If you're gonna be sweating a lot in it, be sure to wash it a lot because polyester can really soak up a lot of smells. Uh, overall, an excellent bang for your buck and they look awesome. My name is Bo Shevesu and I hope that you've enjoyed this small little demonstration of these two little neck scarf thing, which I don't know what they're called, but they're from Skavor and I look forward to reviewing more fun things here on Amazon.